Oh. Hello. Santa? Hi. Hi, this is Courtney. I just wanted you to know that I've been a really good girl this year and I was hoping that you could bring me a really nice gift. I wear a size 7 shoe and I like red bottoms. Um, you know, your favorite color. Anyway, um, call me back when you get this, Santa. You're looking good lately. Okay, bye. Welcome to our YouTube channel. Hi everybody, please don't mind this, I just worked out. Um, but I am about to decorate our house here at Casa Lopez for the holidays. And I thought it would be fun to do a little vlogging and show you some before and after pics of what the house looks like for the holidays. So I hope you guys enjoy it. There is the empty tree. I have no furniture in here. Oh, that's our friend's dog. That's Julio. And here is all of the madness. I am starting, I call this room one, um, the living room, which I kind of do like a winter wonderland. Um, it's my favorite room in the house. Um, and then over there, which I will get to soon, is the family room, which I make like the kids' room. Again, please just ignore this. Um, this is realness right here, realness. Christmas will be over by the time I'm done decorating. I am very bad at organizing how I do things, and I'm looking at the tree, seeing how bare it is, looking at the piano, but I'm gonna focus. I'm gonna do one thing at a time. I'm gonna do this bad boy first, and try and remember how I did it, because unfortunately I lost the pictures from last year. And my memory, as you guys all know, is not very good. I emptied one bin. Oh, I gotta get so excited when I empty bins because I feel like I'm making progress. However, I've only emptied one bin. So my, the, the, my favorite thing is when I get to remove a bin. I still have nothing together. I've wasted about 45 minutes trying to remember how I had things last year. Did I tell you? Realness, realness. Okay, I know it's terrible lighting, but there's nothing I can do. So my tree looks a hot mess right now. Lots of spots, lots of bald spots. Um, I'm gonna fluff it out, and I can't wait for you guys to see the end result. Um, it's gonna look so different, such a makeover. Hi everybody, um, we just started decorating me and Dominic's tree, and I'm just um, fixing the branches so it looks so it doesn't look like it's been crunched for a whole year. Okay, so Nico is helping us decorate the kids' tree. We just started this. Nico, what ornament is that? This is um, Mickey's ship. Mickey's ship when we went yeah. on the Disney cruise. Yeah, and then we want to eat some gumballs. Yeah. Some gumballs. What do you have, Gigi? I have Julio. <gasps> That's the best one. I have this you know, one. I love. This the is the best one too. It is the best one. I love the kids' tree. I have. A lollipop and a bead. Um, <laughs> I have my own ornament that I made. That you made last year. I love this tree with the snow. I think it's so beautiful. But I have to vacuum every day because it makes such a mess on the floor. I don't have the skirt on yet. Mama, can you help me put this on top? Because it is so special. It should go on top. Okay. Okay, so I started decorating four days ago and I'm still not done. But that's why I usually start in the middle of November because it takes me so long. Anyway, I made some progress on this tree. We've been putting on ornaments. Dominic's gonna continue helping me put all the ornaments on. He likes to put them all in the same area and then when he walks out of the room, I rearrange them a little bit. But he doesn't know that. My little, my little elf, say hi. Hi. Okay, this is one of his favorite ornaments. We've had this for a couple years. What is it? Um, dinosaur. It's a dinosaur. Where do you want to put it? Um, next to this. Next to this so we can bite it. You wanted to bite the airplane? Yes. Oh my gosh. Yeah, you put it in there. And these are a new addition this year. I decided to get my home team, the Steelers, and their home team, the Los Angeles um. Chargers, um, and we'll put them together. That sounds like it's gonna break. Okay, it's not. We've already yeah. had one girlfriend dinosaur. Okay, where should we put these? I'm gonna get, uh, How about I'll put this together? Wait, I don't know why I'm in my... I, I know I also try and put all the unbreakable ones towards the bottom just because my kids are in here. 
But they come in here, they move everything, and I just give up. What's that? So we got this, and it says Dominic. Oh. And I like it cause, because it said my name. And I, and I like boxing with Daddy. Okay, where are you going to put it? Um, I just realized you're so festive with your I red and green. Like <laughs> I like them this. And I like this too. Um, because it, cause it looks like Frosty the Snowman. Doesn't it, Mommy? It's so pretty. Doesn't it look like Frosty the Snowman? It is Frosty. Okay, so I started doing this a couple years ago. It was the new trend where there's and then a blah, 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 blah. <laughs> no no tree topper. And then it, a blah, 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 that's it. Oh, that's it. If there's no tree topper. They and just blah, do blah, blah, all blah, of blah, these blah. things that kind of look like they're just shooting out of the tree. Um, so I just found from different places. I like to go to Home Goods, Hobby Lobby, Pier One, and just find some odds and end pieces, um, like these little elf feet that are just sticking out, kind of like a wicked witch when she's under the house. Um, and we just like to have fun with this tree. I do have an obsession with Frenchies, so you know, you do know that. Um, I have a lot of Frenchie ornaments. I have Julio there, these were gifts, Juanita. Frenchies are everywhere. You know what, that just gave me a good idea. Next, I should start a Frenchie tree. I am 99.9% .9 done with the Christmas tree in the kids' room. I just have to put the pretty skirt and vacuum all that white snow that likes to fall. So this is the other thing I do in this room. I just had to clean the thousand toys that were on this because this just becomes, I actually put a bag in um, to give away, but the kids don't know. Do you guys ever do that at home? Give away toys without the kids knowing? Um, anyway, I decorate this for Christmas. This is that phone again, it's not ringing, see? And uh, I'll it's show you broken. what- It's broken. Is it broken? Yeah. Oh. It's broken. This phone is broken? You guys know that phone was driving me crazy. Anyway, I'll be back and show you what this looks like after I'm done. Okay, so I've come back four days later to this tree to have this happening, and I don't know how to fix it. It is driving me insane. Um, so hopefully I report back to you with it being fixed. But I just started now to add these things. I don't know what they're called. Um, where they kind of cascade. I know my tree still looks a little bare, but I'm not done yet. But this is, I guess, the next thing that you do. I don't know. I'm not Martha Stewart. I don't know how, the, I don't know the, the proper order that you do a tree in. Um, but I can't wait to show you what it looks like when it's done. I am finally finished. As you can see, it's dark outside. It took me all day to do this because I had to stop, feed the kids, entertain the kids, feed the dogs, take the dogs out. Anywho, I'm finally done with my tree. Um, this is the end result. Um, I want to tell you a little bit about the tree, though. Uh, my mom started a new tradition um, collecting Swarovski ornaments. So every year she gives me their annual ornaments, and I think I have about eight now. And they're just sporadically placed in the front of the tree, and they just give a little bling, and I think they're so beautiful, and they're from my mama, so they mean the world to me. So that's kind of our new tradition. Growing up, I had a Lennox tree. My mom always had a Lennox tree with Lennox ornaments. So now we're start, kind of starting a new tradition of our own. So I hope you've enjoyed seeing my home for the holidays. Um, it's one of my favorite times of year, uh, Christmas and Halloween. God, I love it. Um, but anyway, please subscribe to our channel, and I hope you guys have a fantastic holiday season. Bye-bye.